Hey, so what's going on guys? Make here with Driven Tech Reviews and welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing this power bank from Mac Dodo. So MC Dodo or whatever you want to call it. So this power bank is actually pretty different from the power banks out there. I mean, your regular MagSafe power banks out there, just like the Apple Smart Battery Pack. It's because this has more than just one function. So this can actually do multiple things, charge multiple devices. All right, so let's quickly get into the unboxing. This retails for around 120 to 140 ringgit, depends on where you buy it from. I got mine from Shopee. So yeah, with the discount, the 88 sale, it was slightly cheaper. So let's take a quick look around the packaging. So you can see right here how the power band looks like. You can see that it has two rings, which I'll show you guys why. And then of course, you can see a highlight of this orange piece right here. Okay, so you can see two in one for iPhone and Apple Watch. So that's the key Apple Watch magnetic wireless power bank. So of course the branding right here. So of course we do have a built-in kickstand as well. So this is 10,000 amps hour. Not sure what's the conversion rate compared to the Apple MagSafe battery pack, but yeah. All right, so you can see the specs right here. You can pause this and read it for yourself. We're just going to get into the unboxing real quick. So this came with around 70%. We have, I believe, some warranty stuff. We have a user manual. And we have another card here for warm tip. So yeah, I guess this means that uh, it needs to like break in. So you have to do a couple of charge cycles and stuff like that. Then it will last longer. We do have the USB-C cable. USB-C to USB-C. Can use any USB-C charger, it will work as well. Okay, let's take out the power bank itself. Okay, all right. So here is the start of the show. This power bank right here, yes. Uh, matte texture, so it feels really good. It has a pretty substantial weight as well. Not too heavy, not too light. If you have used Mophi or Belkin's power banks before, this is roughly the weight of anchor. For reference, yeah, yes, they kind of weight definitely heavier than the MagSafe battery pack. Of course, in terms of the amps hour, this is so much bigger. Okay, so in terms of size comparison, size is slightly bigger, but of course, I would say thickness is about double, or almost double the thickness. But this is good for traveling, so that's the reason why I got this. Okay, let's take a look around the power bank. Of course, we do get Mac dodo branding right here and then what else we do have a uh, led indicator let me show you guys you can see here it's a hundred percent usb-c in and out so this can go both ways i believe there's pass through as well i haven't tested that but uh, i believe it should have then of course we do have the power button all right so let's test this power bank up so let me grab my iPhone. So right here, I do have the iPhone 15 Pro Max. So you see, let me show you guys. See right here, it charges with no problem. So in order to know that this power bank is actually giving the right wattage for the iPhone, you can see right here, it has the MagSafe animation. In fact, see right here. So this is similar to the official MagSafe battery pack. But this, of course, is a smart battery pack. So yeah, it shows the percentage and all. I mean, the ring to show how much charge, but this, of course, doesn't. But it's giving the right amount of wattage. That's why it can actually show the animation. Okay. So now let's test out also the Apple Watch side of things. So this is actually what makes it interesting, the Apple Watch charger, which means that I just need to bring one of this and I can charge a couple of devices. I can charge an iPad, I can charge an iPhone, or any other Samsung device or any other Android device as well because I did try it with my Z Fold 6 with the MagSafe case and it works as well. Okay, let's uh, slap on my Apple Watch. Let me see what it's on. Power this on. It goes to sleep automatically. You can see that it is charging my Apple Watch. Let me just turn this to the right side. So it's really good. Of course, I did try to charge both devices. I mean, I grabbed my Z46 here and then I also charge my Apple Watch and apparently it only charges one at a time. So I believe this power bank is a real steal, especially people who like to travel. So they do have this 
hidden kickstand, which is honestly pretty solid. So let me slap on my iPhone right here. Show you guys. You can see right here how it actually stands up. You can even stand it up straight like this. It doesn't feel like it's going to topple over. They even tried to do this as well. So you can actually do this and watch videos. And then you can see. Yeah, it's pretty top heavy in this way, but you're not going to like be banging your phone around. So yeah. But overall, this is a really, really neat feature, which means that this power bank basically just does it all. And the price is considered very affordable if you compare with the offerings from Mophie, Belkin, and so on and so forth. Even Anchor. Not the cheap nowadays. Definitely, I do recommend this. 1000 amps hour, definitely worth it. Construction is really good. Price is good. Features are good. What's more to love about this power bank right here? So this has been a very quick unboxing and review of the MacDodo MagSafe as well as Apple Watch charger. It's a two-in-one charger. So if you're interested, I will leave the link in the description below if you do want to pick one of these up for yourself because I think this is the most value for money and feature packed power bank that is currently on the market. So thanks guys for watching. Hope you guys like this video. If you did like it, do give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content just like this one. And I'll catch you guys in the next video.